This is the baby right here. Now, this is a video of her brother threatening to fight him. So this is what you want to do. <laughs> this is where you want to take it. This is crazy. This nigga call the cops on my sis. This want to disrespect my sister online for the world to see. Disrespect my family. You know what I'm saying? This don't even got nothing to do with my sister no more, bro. This got to do with me and you. You feel me? Because you missed a tough guy over here beating up, knocking little, little, little guys out here and there. You know what I'm saying? You're not going to do that to me, first off. So this is what we're going to do, bro. You know what I'm saying? I'm in a hospital right now. I got in a car accident. I got my neck. I still beat you my neck like this, bro, on God. You know what I'm saying? So this is what we're going to do. Oh, when you boy. come to the West Coast, bro, which I know you be out here, we're going to catch this one-on-one -on -one fade, bro. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> One-on-one -on -one fade to see what happens between me and you. Look I want to see disclaimer. how much of a gangster you are. How much of a real man you are. You Look know what I'm saying? Disclaimer. We can do that. We can catch this. So this what you Oh, man. This guy said he was in a car accident. This dude is look like he's leaving the hospital with his paperwork. Talking about he read the fight. And look at this disclaimer from the Shade Room. Shade Room LLC does not support or condone bullying or violence in any way. They got to protect that bag. And this is the baby here. Let's see what else he had to say. So I was waiting to make sure my sister was safe. And she is now the baby. Come catch this fade, bro. So I can beat your ass for being a piece of blank. Got it blanked out. Never liked you, clown. Better yet, we could do on live so the whole world could see you get your ass whooped. AKA the snitch. Oh man, but they gonna got the brother involved. He and in he get he in the hospital. Man, come on, man. And you really about to you really about to, listen, man. I wouldn't want nobody disrespecting my relatives, right? But bro, your sister's in love with this guy. Your sister is in love with this guy. Okay, she's in love with this guy. She keeps going back to him. So because she keeps going back to him and he sees that she's desperate for his love, he's going to mistreat her. And that's what a lot of these women don't understand. When you keep going back to a guy that disrespects you, he's going to treat you worse and worse and worse because one, he knows that's what keeps you coming back. And two, he has no love or respect for you. He just uses you. A guy that cares about you is not going to mistreat you and disrespect you. He just ain't going to do that, man. He's not going to tell you to your face on an Instagram live that you're you're basically a side chick. Now I done got the brother involved. Now this thing could turn violent. Man, the baby got all types of paid security, man. I, listen, man. I, this dude's security guard beat up a dude, man, in the mall, man. Do you really think... This guy is not above doing the same thing again. His security put somebody in a hospital, beat this dude up outside of a club and put him in like an intensive care. I, I think he, the dude might've passed away. Uh, those are the type of people that the baby be around. And I'm not saying those guys are gangsters. It's just that those guys don't care about other human beings and they will do things to other human beings. They don't care. And her brother's getting out the hospital after being in an accident. And he has to come and be protective over his sister because his sister's attracted to toxic males. The, the baby security has done a lot of damage, man. I I, I don't know. I, that's not going to be no fair fight. You're not getting no fade. Yeah, I, I don't know about that, bro. Um, but I, But, bro, you need to have a conversation with your sister. And try to figure that situation out, bro. Because it ain't worth you putting your health and in, in whatever well-being at risk, bro. It just isn't, man. She had an opportunity to help herself and she didn't do it. Yeah, man. He's made a complete mockery of Danny Lay. And again, this is the guy she kept going back to. Kept going back to. In this dude's house. She's in this dude's house. Why are you at this dude's house? Why are you there? Do you not have a place of your own? It's clear he didn't want you there. Yeah, and this guy's, you know, got a a hurt neck talking about he want to fight. Bruh, you you know, once you once you 
get off those meds or whatever you want man you're gonna realize oh did i post that video and she gonna go she gonna go right back to the baby probably within the next week that's what these toxic relationships do and, that, and that's what happens listen if i have a relative or a sister that dates toxic males and keeps going back to them i'm not about to fight over her because she's choosing to involve herself with somebody that is no good for her what am, what am i gonna do about that? i ain't about to sit up i ain't about to fight nobody you better fight that battle thing yourself to not be attracted to these type of men and now she got a baby with him brother's broken down to the brake pads and still choosing violence she will absolutely go back for sure oh yeah man this dude is limping and holding his neck and he's talking about fighting man this guy this guy's on medication man this dude probably was told to rest for about a week or two no movements you can't go back to work or whatever you're doing and you talking about fighting so this is what you want to do <laughs> this way you want to take it this crazy this nigga called the cops on my sis this gonna disrespect my sister online for the world to see disrespect my family you know what i'm saying this don't even got nothing to do with my sister no more bro this got to do with me and you you feel me because you missed the tough guy over here beating up knocking little 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 guys out here and there you know what i'm saying you're not gonna do that to me first off so this is what we're gonna do bro you know what i'm saying i'm in a hospital right now i got in a car accident i got neck i still beat you my neck like this bro on god you know what i'm saying so this is what we're gonna do when you come to the west coast bro which I know you be out here, we gonna catch this one-on-one -on -one fade, bro. You know what I'm saying? One-on-one -on -one fade to see what happens between me and you. I wanna see how much of a gangster you are, how much of a real man you are. You know what I'm saying? We could do that, we could catch this. So this is what you wanna do. <laughs> this way you wanna take it. This crazy. This nigga called the cops on my sis. This gonna disrespect my sister online for the world to see. Disrespect my family. You know what I'm saying? This don't even got nothing to do with my sister no more, bro. This got to do with me and you. You feel me? Because you missed the tough guy over here beating up Knocking little, little, little guys out here and there. You know what I'm saying? You're not going to do that to me, first off. So this is what we're going to do, bro. You know what I'm saying? I'm in a hospital right now. I you got Wack 100 talking about how he'll catch the fade for the baby. I got in a car accident. I got neck. I still beat you up my neck like this, bro. On God. You know what I'm saying? So this is what we're going to do. When you come to the West Coast, bro, which I know you be out here, we're going to catch this one-on-one -on -one fade, bro. You know what I'm saying? One-on-one -on -one fade to see what happens between me and you. I want to see how much of a gangster you are, how much of a real man you are. You know what I'm saying? We could do that. We could catch this. So this. I'm just, this has been a, this this has been a heck of a Monday, hasn't it? Bro, you're, 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 you're your sister, man, she made that choice, man. You got to let her go. I know she's crying. She's probably calling you, texting you, but she's only doing that because she's losing on the internet. She's taking a lot of losses on the internet and she's getting completely clowned. But bro, you should not be putting yourself in any type of harm's way over your sister who for the last three years has been on and off again with a guy that has been embarrassed the, the baby has been embarrassing her for you for for months he's been embarrassing your sister man making her look bad and she's taking it and she's going right back to him man there's nothing you can do when these women are in love with these guys there's nothing you can do bro not a thing you're gonna be able to do bro it's up to her to break that curse but until then she's gonna ride with him And this dude got a hurt neck, and he's talking about fighting. And he got whack 100 talking about here catch. Man, come on. This dude probably was hurt making that video, man. Oh, yeah, Danny Lee is falling completely off, man. But the this thing is becoming bad, man. Yeah, yeah, she don't want to be saved, man. Even if she your sister, man, she can't be saved, man. I don't care what she telling you. Tell her to handle that business on her own. When you try to come to the rescue... Of somebody that don't want to help themselves you're only making yourself look bad you're only making yourself look bad there's too many males 
that have tried to come to the defense of women ended up getting the short end of that stick. She can't be saved, man. She is lost. And she got a baby by this guy. She's lost. She's a lost cause, man. Sometimes you gotta let people go, man. Even if she your sister, you gotta let her go, man. She's chosen her route. She'll be back with this dude within the next week or two. I guarantee you. Because she's been embarrassed by him before. She's been embarrassed by the baby before. This ain't this is nothing new. She's done this before. She's always getting embarrassed by the baby. Always. Always embarrassing her, humiliating her, dumping her, going back to his baby mother, getting back with her, dumping her again. She almost got canceled over showing her love for this guy. This is the life she chose, man. This is the life she chose, man. This is what she's chosen, bro. Some of these women got to learn the hard way. That no, you're not going to, no one's going to come to your defense when you're out here making conscientious, stupid decisions over and over and over. Nobody's coming to your aid. You made that choice. You're going to have to deal with that. Period. You're going to have to deal with that. And now she has a baby by this guy. Now she's going to be attached to this guy forever. And the brother does not need to be getting involved, man. I, unless he has some plan. <laughs> he done planned something. You know, maybe maybe get into a celebrity boxing ring or something. No, but I know that's not going to happen. But that's where you can really settle your differences. But, but this whole trying to, you know, trying to... Man, I could tell this dude, man. I don't think he no street dude. I don't think he really out here like that. Nobody, nobody shoots a fair one anymore, man. Nobody, nobody shoots a fair one anymore. You know what's funny? When I first heard about the baby, right, and I saw his music video, he was wearing that diaper. I thought he was a joke. I really did. But the guy has talent as far as you know what he does artistically with his videos. You know he's a good rapper. But if you look, listen to this guy and his background and where he came from, you're going to know that he has no room for love with a woman. He will sleep with them, but I don't think he has genuine love towards the women that he deals with. All you have to do is look at his background. He didn't grow up with any love, especially from his mother like that. I'm not saying his mother didn't love him, but I'm just saying if you look at where he came from in his background, like you know, he 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 uses women. He does you know he uses them for what he can. But he's not looking to wife or marry any of them. But that's a choice Danny Lee made, man. That, and that's all I can really say on that. But